Hello, I'm Kelly from Pushchair Expert. Eye Candy offers something for everyone with their pushchairs, from all terrain to compact, one that can do a bit of everything to a full blown tandem. Their latest addition to the brand is certainly different, while holding Eye Candy's beliefs and values of quality, heritage, innovation, and style to the core. This is the Eye Candy Core. And like many of their pushchairs, the Eye Candy Core is a single, so can't convert to take a second child. Instead, it has a clever chassis that can transform from an urban to an all-terrain pushchair that takes seconds to do. Everything is included in the box too, so no hidden extras. Also has a built-in ride on board that can carry up to 20 kilos for your older child. Has lots of features that they've learned that parents love, like the carry cot being suitable for overnight sleep and having the largest of all eye candy seat units to make sure it lasts and can perform as the only pushchair you'll need. You can purchase the Eye Candy Core in a combi with a carry cot, in a bundle with all of the accessories, or as a full travel system with an infant carry of your choice. We love that you receive the Eye Candy 5 year warranty, which should see you through one or even two children. The Core is available in five beautiful colours, Atlantis Blue, Black Edition, Dark Grey, Light Grey and Light Moss. This gives a shade for everyone and we are testing out the Black Edition. Such a classy option with a matching jet black chassis. The other colours come on a phantom chassis, which you might recognise from the Peach 7, and is a dark metallic grey. Like we've mentioned, the core is a feature that sets itself apart from other pushchairs, and that is the multi-mode wheelbase. This means that the pushchair comes with both an urban and rural set in the box, so you can switch the wheels to best suit your lifestyle, or even on a daily, weekly, monthly basis as you need it. Lots of parents will downgrade to a smaller stroller once baby gets a bit older, so having this feature means that the core could be the only pushchair that you need. The urban setup has smaller wheels and the chassis is moved to a shorter wheelbase. This takes up less space, weighs less and is ideal for nipping around the shopping centres and using on smooth pavements. It's easy to adjust, simply press the centre of the rear wheels and the back of the front wheels to remove, then pop the smaller wheels in their place. Then press the buttons on the inside of the middle of the frame and push the front of the chassis in. You can then realign the velcro on the inside of the basket to shorten the material. This does also decrease the size of the shopping basket slightly, but only by two litres. There's an arrow on the chassis that will line up with the mode you're in to see it at a glance. Reverting back to rural mode is just as easy. Unfasten the basket, press the buttons while moving the chassis out and move the velcro to the larger setting. Then switch your wheels to the bigger size. If you need your pushchair to be chunky and capable of most terrains, then this is the option for you. Having a pushchair that is so versatile means that it caters for lots of family needs and can be used on all your trips out without needing to auto purchase a lighter, more compact stroller. It also means that little one is kept in a familiar, comfortable space on each ride out to, whether in the carry cot or seat unit. We found that the push is just as good in urban mode as it is in rural. You can feel the bounce of the suspension on each of the wheels as you cover the ground has a very light push that's easily manoeuvred and capable of turning tight corners. As well as smoother floors, we've also taken it on cobbles, grass and tracks without any issue, with the larger wheels designed to handle it all. While going across rougher terrain, it's easy to lock the front wheels by twisting the dials to keep you in a straight line. Receiving eight wheels of your pushchair is unheard of, and we love that Eye Candy provides a little bag to keep your other set safe and clean. Not only does this allow you to use the best set suited for your trip out, but it also means that you have backup wheels should you have a particularly muddy park walk and then need to take your pushchair food shopping the next day. Just switch your wheels and think about cleaning the mess later. All of the wheels have the same hexagon shapes in them as their tread. Eye Candy have designed each part of this pushchair beautifully. If you are using the core with an older child, they can hitch a ride in the integrated ride on board that is built into the back of the chassis. Capable of carrying 20 kilos, it means you don't need to buy anything to stick out at the back in your way of walking. Your child can stand comfortably between the handlebar of the pushchair while they chat with your toddler or gaze in the carry cot of their new baby brother or sister. The included elevators move the seat or carry cot further forwards to give them plenty of room. It's a great way of future proofing this pushchair through two or more children if you have the right age gap. To stop and start the pushchair, there's a press on and off brake just behind the right rear wheel. Easy to access, it's definitely flip flop friendly and has a green and red indicator to alert you. We've seen pushchairs before with lights, but the LED visibility hub light is on each side of the pushchair to offer the best illumination and visibility of your pushchair if you're walking in dark or low light conditions. Mm -hmm. 
iCandy provides a small key that you use to remove the hub light from your pushchair so that you can plug it into charge, as well as a charging cable too. It's easy to take out using the tool, just push into the hole until it pops out. It takes a couple of hours to charge and then lasts up to 72 hours. It's also water and dust resistant. To turn on the light, just press the centre of the hub light and it spins around and stays on until you press it again. We've tested the cause lights out in the darker nights and it really does make the pushchair stand out. The handlebar of the core can be adjusted with one hand from 91.5 to 103 centimetres, which will cover the majority of parents with a short or tall. Covered in a textured leatherette, it does take a bit of getting used to, as the majority of pushchairs have a much smoother finish to hold. It's not uncomfortable though, and adds to the style of the pushchair, with those geometric shapes making an appearance again. One of the things that sets the aesthetics of the core apart is the style of the basket on the pushchair. With a fan shape threading the front of the chassis to the rear, has a great capacity of 46 to 48 litres and 10 kilos, depending on which mode you set up in. As both sides are completely covered, all the other items are kept nice and secure, with the back being quite high too. There's also a drainage hole at the bottom to let out any rain, liquid or sand that might otherwise collect there. Another big design feature of this pushchair, which you may hear a lot about in our review, is the hexagonal geometric shapes that cover the pushchair. They're everywhere, from the caricot apron, seat fabrics, plastics of the ride on board, foot plate, handlebar, wheels and even the adapters. All ties in beautifully and gives another texture and dimension to the core. As your caricot's one of the first places for baby to travel, it must be comfortable, cosy and safe for them. With the iCandy Core, you receive a matching caricot that can be used from birth up to around six months or a maximum of nine kilos. The apron that zips into place also features the same 3D design with raised sections stitched in. The inside is lined with a soft fleece material and has those honeycomb shapes embossed into the fabric. This can be taken completely out if you need to clean it. You might notice that the caricot on the core has a much softer look than other eye candy caricots. The frame on the outside has completely gone for a seamless, smooth look. Don't worry though, it's just as strong and suitable for overnight sleep, which means no scratchy travel cot mattresses are needed for your tiny newborn in those first six months. The hood on the caricot is a good size and pulls right over baby to prep from sun or wind. You do receive a different hood for your caricot and seat unit, so make sure you get the right one for the best fit. The seat unit one has an extendable zip panel, so you can have two different sizes, whereas the caricot hood is always at the bigger size. The hood is made from a thick, luxury jersey material that is almost squidgy and super soft to the touch. The back panel can be lifted to give extra ventilation and airflow through the caricot. Include in your pushchair box with elevators. These two adapters can pin to the pushchair and can be used to increase the height of your caricot or seat unit on the frame. Use spacing you to bring baby closer and higher. Use the other way to move baby higher and further away to create more space for a child using the built-in ride on board. To remove the caricot from the chassis, you can lift one lever and then the other, and then pull up with your bumper bar. When using it on the elevators though, it is a two-handed operation, needing you to lift the levers at each side simultaneously. We'd love to see full memory buttons to make this job a bit easier to do. Something that parents are looking for when purchasing their pushchair is a decent sized seat unit that will last their child until they no longer want to use it. iCandy have listened to their fan base and given us their largest seat unit to date, on the core. When reclined, it measures 110 centimetres from the top to the bottom of the footrest. The lie flat seat on the iCandy core can be used from birth right up to 25 kilos, which is more than most children of around four years old will be. Having the 60 centimetre back height of the seat as well as their weight limit will make sure you get the most out of your pushchair and give you great longevity. It's also handy that you can use the seat with a newborn for those days when space is at premium and you can't fit the caricot in. The sides are slightly built up to protect baby but you can add a foot muff which is probably beneficial for smaller babies. You can use the seat unit parent and world face and it's simple to switch it around. Pull the two catches at each side of the seat and lift. Again, you can do one at a time if you aren't using the elevators, but if you are, then you need to lift at the same time with both hands. Although easy enough, it would be better if there were proper memory buttons in place. Additional modes are created with the seat on the elevators, though this does decrease the weight limit from 25 to 15 kilos. When used forward facing, it moves the seat up and forward, which is a perfect position for table height if you're eating out. When parent facing, you can have it either closer and higher to you, or again, further away to give room on the ride on board. To recline the backrest of the seat, just lift the lever on the back and choose from four different positions. We love the lie flat option as well as the fully upright position that you can achieve for older toddlers too. When fully reclined, the leg rest of the core can be popped up to give a great flat position for small legs. 
It also lengthens the seat to ensure that they can stretch out. Again, this is adjustable with different positions to move through using the buttons on the sides. Inside the seat is stitching, giving you more hexagon shapes and quite a structured feeling to the separate sections, backrest and base. Saying that it's still extremely thick and padded in the base and backrest to give great comfort to any child. To keep little ones secure is a five point harness. We love that the padded covers help to keep the straps open to place your child in the seat. The shoulder parts clip onto the waist section and can be fastened separately or just two sections into the buckle at a time. It would have been nice to see a magnetic harness added here, so many brands are now using it on their push chairs. This harness is very similar to what we've seen before from Eye Candy. It's very easy to use though with a large Eye Candy button in the centre of the buckle used to release it. The headrest cushion in the seat has a dual purpose. It gives a bit more cushioning for your child's head, but also can be pulled up and down to just the height of the harness. Very clever. Being able to move the harness up in one swift movement makes it super easy to adjust when your child is growing or just wearing different clothes to suit the weather. A bumper bar with matching leatherette sits over the front of the child. Gate opening from either side, you can also completely remove it if you wish. It sits nicely away from the seat to allow space to slide a small child in behind it without removing it. The second hood that you need for your seat unit is it's neatly in place and has a nice height away from the seat to give plenty of headroom for older children. It's also a great size as it has a concealed zip that allows you to extend it further down. You can lift the back to reveal a large viewing window with mesh ventilation. Great for airflow and peeking on the little one in the seat. Made from the same material as the carry cot, it's thick and luxurious with a real quality feel to it. Both hoods have an SPF 50 plus rating. As well as your elevators, the Eye Candy Core comes with car seat adapters. These perfectly transform your pushchair into a full travel system to take one of the main car seat brands on the chassis without an additional expense. Although you can buy the Core as just the pushchair and carry cot, you can also purchase it as a bundle with accessories. For an extra £170, you'll also receive a matching foot muff and liner, changing bag, screen, parasol and cup holder. The foot muff is lined with an opulent and soft fleece in your matching colour to keep little one warm. Covered with stitching to give you the same honeycomb shapes as a seat, you can double it up as a seat liner too in warmer weather. It's fully reversible to make the most of the plain or fleece sides. This is a fab way to protect your seat unit at all times of the year, whether they're munching on ice cream or sausage rolls. Going with the fashion trends of modern day parents, the changing bag is a backpack style. Much easier and comfortable to carry out of the way on your back, with both hands free. It does have a satchel style feel though, with two straps and buckles over the front. They aren't real buckles to unfasten though, using magnets instead to keep the front secure. Inside there are multiple pockets to keep everything organised and a changing mat that is easy to clean. We love how the whole front of the bag drops down so that you can fully see inside. No more rustling around inside like Mary Poppins. There's also no need to take up important basket space with your bag either. It has integrated bag hooks which allows it to hang neatly from the knobs on the inside of your handlebar. The core fold is very similar to that of the Peach 7. While sliding one grey button and squeezing the other, you push the handlebar into the frame. Then grab the bar that runs through the basket and lift up. The automatic lock will keep it all together while you transport it and it's freestanding for easier storage. To get it back upright, slide the grey button on the central bar of the frame left and it will release the front wheels. Then just lift your handle up to be on your way. One big difference with this eye candy pushchair is that you can also fold the pushchair with a seat unit attached. This is fab for those cold and wet wintry days where you just need to get the pushchair in your car boot quickly without having to leave anything on the floor whilst you get sorted. To fold with your seat unit in place, first use the recline lever on the back of the seat to fold it forwards, then you can lift up with a handle on the back of the seat. You can also do it with the seat parent facing. Push the seat forward slightly to the handlebar until you can lift the footrest and then push both sections the other way towards the front wheels. Then continue as before. It's quite light to lift from 5 kilos on the frame alone without wheels and up to 12.6 kilos with the seat unit and everything in place. It's a good size to fit in most family car boots too. Even if you fold them without the seat unit on in two pieces, the seat unit clamshell folds in half to take up less space and keep it clean. It can sometimes be difficult for new parents to appreciate the differences between pushchairs at a first look, but we think the Eye Candy Core really stands out from the crowd. Not only does it have some amazing features and acts like the transformer of the pushchair world, but it also is on point style-wise, from the unique fan basket shape, curved chassis and geometric shapes that cover it from hood to wheel.
Once parents go deeper than just looks, they'll also find a pushchair that's practical and can handle day-to-day -day life with a newborn, right through to a preschooler. Eye candy has been around long enough now to know things need to look amazing whilst being simple for baby brains to operate. And we think they've got the equation just right with the core. We give the eye candy core 4.8 out of 5 stars. Head over to pushchairexpert.com to read our full review.